So today we're doing one of the last jobs I need to do before I go to drift day, which is a DIY quick release. If every time you come to a corner, you want to drag the handbrake, you don't want to be doing that. Or you might go yank it like that and then accidentally let go of it halfway down and you drive around with the handbrake on. So when I first bought my old car, I used to put like a two pence piece at the end, push it in and then wrap some gaffer tape around it. That works, but sometimes if it's a really hot day and you're using it a lot, it sort of starts to sweat and it sometimes moves back out and still gets jammed. So what I found the next best cheap trick is to use a drill like this one here drill a hole in the side get a little screw something like this here and just screw that in if you really care about your handbrake gator either get another one or take it off on mold 14 if you had like a plastic cover up over here you could take that cover off i'm not particularly worried be careful not to drill your finger that is very easily done doing this That feels pretty good. I can feel that I've gone through. But you can just see the very top. If you can see that in there, you can just see the top of the hole. Oh, it's going in nice and snug. There we go. Perfect. So, you're flying down, give it a quick flick, down the gears. Lovely jobby. You get to drive home if you say you've driven to the drift day. Just undo it again. There you go. He's uh, probably back to being a ratchet, and all you've got is a tiny little screw hole there, which, to be honest, to the average person would hardly even be noticeable. Most drift cars are half stripped out anyway. 